Okay, everybody, um, I'm here again today. Um, I don't know how many other videos I put out today, but uh, I'm going to be making some Haymakers Punch. Um, another channel has made this uh, particular drink, um, but I've, uh, I'm doing it slightly differently than they did. Um, now I get uh, one of these coffee pot things full and then I put it in to the pot here like this and then uh, I get a little bit of mint. I can't, I planted a whole bunch of this around my house and uh, I let it grow through the summer and stuff like that. Um, now, if I can get this opened, um, yeah, okay, got it open now, and, uh, keep in mind, I'm doing this to taste, okay, so, I, uh, throw that much in, like that, and then go back in the glass jar, and uh, put about that much in, roughly speaking. Um, you can put a little more or a little less, um, but yeah, I. Uh, Put that in, and then I go into the fridge here, and I grab two lemons here, and then I uh, grab some ginger here, uh, I got to cut it down and then uh, got to get the honey. Once I get the lemons cut up, um, I would say about that much ginger roughly that you see and the two lemons, once I get them cut up, I will come back. All right, I'm back. Now I've got the lemons cut up right to here. I peeled them and I put each peel of the lemons into um, each lemon peel. I put into um, another jar. There are 500 milliliter jars. So that's why I got the two. Um, I'll show you what I'll do with that at the end of the video. But I put the two lemons here and there. And uh, I like that. And then I got the um, ginger there. I leave the peels on it. Um, and then when uh, I'm done um, with it, uh, when I go to strain it out after, what I will do is I will freeze it and put it in a plastic bag like that, just the ginger, and then I will dehydrate it um, for consumption down the road. Um, so I've got the, um, that in there, all that stuff into the punch stuff, and I've got my honey here, and then, I will 
add two um turn this all the way up to high and then I'll put that one in let it melt as it's the water's heating up um and then now back to the lemon peels um in these jars I grab um white vinegar um and then just pour it in to the jars here so that there's just enough head space there and each one there And then I close it up nice and both of them nice and tight and just shake it up. Like that, the pair of them like that. And then I will just leave them sit somewhere. Put them on top of the fridge for now. Um, because I can actually use that for cleaning. Because um, um, uh, vinegar is a cleaning thing and so is lemon. Um, um, so that's how I get my uh, clean some cleaning stuff um, done around the house because I'm on a septic tank. So I'll do that. Um, but that's for another discussion later. Now I'm adding that second spoon full. So it's two of these, um, which comes to about maybe uh, three, six tablespoons roughly speaking and I'm just doing this to my taste um, but I do uh, so uh, like that and then I bring the water to a boil and then or just before a boil and then I will turn it on low and uh, then I will add some apple cider vinegar. Um, I would say I gotta get. Uh, um, hmm. I'll get one of these mason jars up here somewhere so I can at least show you how much I put into there. This is uh, just a small jar that I use regularly. Um, I use get the four liter jugs, but uh, this is a 500 ml um, glass jar. And then, so I add about that much of a 500 ml jar. And then the coffee pot there. Um, then when that's all boiled uh, or simmered, I put it down to low. Then um, what I will do is this. And when it's done, I strain it out um, and all the stuff out. And I'll save the ginger and freeze it. I'll throw the lemons away and throw the mint away into the compost thing. Um, and then uh, you got your haymakers punch. Um, 
and so it's it's just about ready to where I want to uh, turn it down to low. Um, there. I listen for the water again, but uh, I just make sure that at least the honey is uh, melted enough in there. Um, so yeah, that's about ready. Then I turn it all the way on low. Um, so you see how it says keep warm, but I push one more. The lowest setting for the low on my ceramic stove top, and then I leave it sit there uh, 20 minutes or so, and then I strain it out into a coffee maker pot there, and then, uh, let it cool down, and then I'll add the, um, apple cider vinegar, and then you got your haymaker's punch, put it into the fridge, and, uh, you got yourself homemade juice from the 1800s. Um, I hope you, uh, Make some because it's good in the electrolytes. Um, the ginger is good for if you're sick. Um, the lemons are good for you. The mint's good for you. Um, it's got a lot of benefits for you. Um, but anyways, I hope you find this useful.